What's up, guys? It's your boy. I took you out. Got here with that uh, hands-on review of the Google Keeps application, which has now received a big, minor enhancement update. Um, but I think it's a major improvement uh, for the application itself because now with the Google Keeps app, and let me go ahead and open it up. You can now doodle. Now I don't know if you guys can see that. Let me dim down the brightness of it. Yeah, you can now Google uh, doodle on. That's like Google. <laughs> you can now doodle on it. Uh, oh, let me dim it up just a little bit. But yeah, it's kind of hard to see for some reason. Um, let me just dim it back down again. But yeah, so you can now write. Um, just adding, add drawing, and then you can um, pick down here from three different options. I guess you got your pencil like or your pen and then you got your marker and then you also have the highlight but what's underneath the hood is you I wouldn't say double tap but you tap it again and then you can see all these other colors so you have green you have a uh, green red yellow oh then you have some more colors too so Okay, that that's the arrow. You you part that down and minimize it, then make it wider. So now you can have all these different types of colors, and you can doodle, you can draw, you can write. So you have all that functionality now on the uh, the Google Keeps application, which um, is a APK file that you have to download. So if you want to try this out, guys. Um, I'll leave a link in the description for the APK. Um, I think it's a a, re, uh, a cutoff for the requirement. I think you probably have to have like Android 4.0 and up or 5.0 and up. But it's just a big improvement um, enhancement that Google has made and um, given out and updated the Google Keeps to allow you to do all these things now. So. Now you can doodle, uh, Google, I mean, oh my gosh, Google doodle. <laughs> now you can do, do, uh, doodle and write and all sorts of things now that Google keeps alongside with, you know, your grocery list. So yesterday I had a grocery list. You can also voice, um, voice command. Um, you can even share uh, images. And then you can also say to uh, Google Docs. So let's say I want to send this to Google Docs. I can go ahead and make a copy, and then it'll upload to Google Docs. And then once it's copied, it says done and open, and it'll open right into Google Docs application. As you can see, it's loading up now. So yes, yeah, it's, it's a lot of new functionalities, new features. Um, I say check it out, guys. Um, this is the Google Keeps uh, hands-on um, review. I would say it's a it's a big step in what Google's trying to do, um, especially if you have a Nexus line uh, device and a uh, Nexus tablet. This will definitely come in handy. And as you can see, I was using the actual stylus. And um, <laughs> this is not, this is a big stylus. I'll probably do a separate video about different types of stylus you can use on tablets and smartphones and uh, laptops with touchscreen. But this is a big stylus. It's really nothing major, just like a tool in one you can actually use it as an ink pen as well and you have a stylus on the bottom. Now I do have this one stylus, it has the, the point down there with the ink pen so it's kind of weird that they did that but like I said that's a separate video but yeah guys this is just my uh, hands on and review of the uh, Google Keep some update and like I said I'll leave a link in the description for the APK file to get the drawing um, to get the drawing and uh, writing um, options. Alright, Shibu, I'll take you out, guy. Peace.